Hi everyone and welcome to new tutorial so in uh, Autodesk Inventor it's not in SOLIDWORKS uh, this tutorial let's continue the cylinder block then see this is the reference and choose this face okay let's see from here let's start with the circle the circle has 30 in diameter the distance between this and this one between this and this we have 125 and add the relation between these and go to 3D model extruded with one millimeter choose this and go to circle put here 20 and add the relation between this one and this then you can go to extruded extruded with 37 then I will put here the water pump here then we will put the location of it start with the circle circle has the diameter of 40 then we have the distance from the bottom we have 190 and add the relation between this and this one then you can use this feature with 45 now you can use transfer you transfer with 10 here not 20 and select this click OK and I will add the hole here three holes with a um, point the point from here we have we have 25 mm, we have to repeat this with this one choose this one like axis and put three here click OK go to hole here the holes we have to put diameter of uh, five or four if you want then then we have to to go to another site return your model like this and select this face click sketch then see from here you can you can convert to this one and start from it then put these dimension 20 15 and we have 12 from here then extrude it you can choose here to to 
I want to say I want to choose this one mm, I can't no if I can choose this one this is the profile can I choose this? ok then click ok hmm, the same thing in this side choose this and convert this one then use your rectangle the same distance but we have just to put here 32 then the same thing we have 20 here and 15 here 3D model mm. it should cut you can choose here to to this one then click OK now we use this fillet fill it with 30 the same thing in this side apply then uh, 30 and 30 here again click apply and do we have to put here I have to put 5 here the same thing in this mother side click apply then repeat this one from uh, here to here repeat it with this function or feature put here mm, can put I think 90 switch the direction and seven times I click OK Now save your file, then let's return to our uh, water pump, select this one, and go to sketch, see from here, and start the sketch from this one. We have 15 here. We have any distance we have seven here and five here and the return to this one and the return to the origin I can't see the origin but the wireframe return to this one now choose this okay and you can add the distance we have 60 here mm. we have 42 from here mm. 
then uh, make this one equals this and this one the last thing to add is from here this and this point is fully defined fully defined then go to shut edges uh, no before this I will have to to make it mirror select this one and convert it to to construction geometry then select all of these this and this one okay then you can hmm, can convert it and make it mirror click apply and okay you can delete this if you want no I want to delete it cut this with let's see with distance we have to put here 520 okay I click OK then I will add here with 5 millimeter choose loop here click apply and Uh, we can't put five let's put three we can't and two we can't again one millimeter we can't yes we can and you can select all of these and we have an error here because this feature is not good let's modify it for holes this one you can put here mm, 30 and that's okay now you can return to this one and choose your edges I click apply then here we have to put 5 then choose these it's not this it's not this I want to select oh, I'm so tired select this and this click apply the same thing from this side okay um, I think it's time to leave you this then uh, if you can um, I think it's it's easy to continue but I think you have 
to have the dimension to continue. Let's uh, let's just see what we have. We have many 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 things to do next tutorial. Okay. See you next tutorial. And if you like it, you can leave me a comment or if you have any question to do this, don't hesitate to post uh, your question. Then thank you for all subscribers and see you in next tutorial.